back again to the rock chicks. Today, we will form a chemical reaction which turns a beaker mixture from a colourless to dark blue. We will need to use three chemicals. Potassium iodate, 10 millilitres, 20 millilitres of acidified sodium bisulfite and 5 millilitres of distilled water. Let's begin. First of all, we need to pour in the potassium iodate, which is already in the beaker. Next, we need to pour a mixture of sodium bisulfite and distilled water into the beaker. This mixes all of the chemicals together. After me starting the timer, I mix it. Anton will swirl the beaker to completely mix the chemicals. And finally, after about 18.6 seconds of swirling, the mixture suddenly turns blue. However, without the 5 millilitres of distilled water in the beaker, this would have only taken. 13.9 seconds. Scientific explanation. When the chemicals and water are mixed, there is no clear reaction at first, but after a short while, the liquids suddenly turn dark blue. In this version of the experiment, iodized iron is generated first within the reaction. The remaining potassium iodate will oxidise this iodide iron to generate iodine. However, less iodine is reduced immediately back to iodide by the sodium bisulfite. When the bisulfite runs out, the iodine will survive. Iodine is blue, therefore it forms a dark, starchy blue complex.